Hey everyone. Um have you ever have you ever done something that you know you're going to regret but you sort of do it anyway? Someone gifted me this game um and I'm not going to say their name uh because either a they don't want to probably be uh linked to this, which is fair enough. Um they wanted to get away with it like robbing a 7-Eleven. I understand. Or alternatively, they got some sort of sick pleasure out of giving me this game. There, let, let me tell you, there are two t types of people in this world. They're the type of people that give you a game like Major Minor, the visual novel for furries. And then there are the type of people who give you RimWorld. I got both on the same day from two different people. RimWorld is sort of like um, Dwarf Fortress with, with better graphics and, and less depth. And, and then there's this, which is not good at either of those things. I'm going to play it. We're going to do a speed run. And that's going to start as soon as I press uh, this. There are no options. It actually starts uh, fully window maximized. And if I try and window it, uh, it, it acts like it's shitting the bed and will not capture. It's actually one of the first uh, games that I've ever seen that has a very special error with OBS is actually kind of marvelous in how awful it interacts with OBS. A lot of programs that, you know, you have to do like anti-cheat linking or whatever, but this, this, this fucking game, this fucking game just does whatever the fuck it wants. Like it, sometimes it'll accept the window. Sometimes it won't. I don't know if it's actually recording and I'm going to fucking lose my goddamn mind if it's not, cause I'm going to be playing all the way through this. But if I alt F4, it might not fucking do it anyway. Um, New game. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is just it saying that you can press F4 in order to do stuff. Um, you can save. And uh, there, there's no way to increase the speed of the text like in most of these games. Um, and I actually do not have any idea how long this game is. There's a website I use. Holy fuck, that's loud. Uh, there's a, uh, a website I use to figure out. Oh, fuck. Yes. First name, hmm? Yes, that is my, my furry name. First name. Let me... Are you going to ask what my last name is? Are you going to actually make this into an actual game? Is this made with RPG Maker? Because I've heard that this is a visual novel. But, like, does this have, like, mechanics where I have to move around and, like, actually make decisions? Oh, God. <sighs> but, yeah, there's a website that I, um... That I use in order to, um... Can I, can I actually speed this up? No, no, it, it actually is just this speed. This is this is the speed that they intended. We're going to Tokyo. Um, if I hold down space and press enter, oh no, oh no, do not design characters like this. I'm sorry if you're one of the people who worked on this. I'm sure that like this is a highly respected game within the furry community or whatever. I, I'm just not. And I understand that, you know, different strokes for different folks, and sometimes those strokes are on dog dicks. But, like, that that is, that's just not my, my cup of tea, man. Like, it's just not me. Anyway, I was talking about it. There's this, there's this website that I use sometimes that, um, that's called, uh, How Long to Beat. And it gives me a general idea. Like, if a game takes, like, two hours to beat, like, then I know that the speed run will be, like, an hour. Or, like, I mean, like, a couple of minutes. Like, 30 minutes at most. Uh, 15. Something like that. I think it's, like, 10 minutes for an hour, depending on the tech speed. Uh, but this game, no one has admitted to, um, to having an opinion on. Um, like, no one has ever played this game according to that website though it has very positive reviews on steam so uh if if you like what you're seeing you can go get it it costs money i didn't bother to check how much because i kind of figured the people who are watching my content aren't the type of people who would actually like this um Is this like the Matrix? He keeps referring to the arc. I'm kind of trying to read it, but I think this is straight up like the furry Matrix. This is the furry Matrix. This is the furry Matrix. That's what this is, isn't it? I'm gonna look at the, the fucking... Can you imagine if Neo was a goddamn, like, ferret? Or something? Like, 
No, that that has too much personality. It's got to be something more boring, like a turtle. Neo could be a turtle, but not not a ferret. Ferrets have too much like energy and personality and and What is that guy's name? It's not Orlando Bloom. I want to say Orlando Bloom, but that's not who played uh, Neo in the Matrix. He's that guy whose like entire repertoire of of character is just like whoa, and speaking in a monotone, which I really shouldn't be shitting on him for because people give me shit for that. And you know what? M power to you, man. You you did you were a cultural icon for like uh, five years. Is there a way to can to shift speed this up? Nothing, nothing speeds this up. And I've got to keep one hand on the the the, the left clicking because the left clicking is the thing, and the, the the I've got to be able to select options, which will cause um, things to happen later. If this takes if this game takes a fucking hour, I'm tempted to start a timer now, just to see how long. Like I've got you know a timer on screen right now for you guys, but like. Unless if I don't. Like, if I don't, like, it's because I've just given up on life. Or given up on this shit. <sighs> can, can I, can I talk about something? So I'm an artist, right? I, I, I have a BFA, basically. Um, I like how I have to say basically. Um, but anyway. Uh, the, the school I went to didn't have a formal fine arts program, but it technically, uh, anyway. Uh, so I have an art degree. And so when, when we're going to a maid cafe, is that really? Okay. Um, <clears throat> when you do art, you kind of got to make sure that like you, you, you pay the bills and you know, YouTube, you know, especially with insert recent drama of YouTube, like, um, they, they happen so often that like it, it could be fucking anything. Um, What was I talking about? I'm sorry. Th this weird... It, this is the Matrix, isn't it? Is he an otter? What are you? Anyway, as an artist, you gotta make sure that money's on the table. Like, if you do any job, you gotta make sure there's art... Uh, there's, he's angry with me. Well, fuck you, Rook. Um, if, you, if you do any job or profession, you kind of expect that you need to, to make enough money to pay for your, your living conditions, your house, your, your whatever. So, I, I've been doing commissions recently. And when I first started doing commissions, I, I left it open because I didn't remember that furries existed. I remembered porn, and I was like, you know what? PayPal has rules against porn. I can't do porn. It, it's sort of a don't get caught situation with PayPal, to be honest. But whatever. Anyway, so some furries messaged me as soon as I, I did it, and that's fine, honestly. Like, th there's the that legend on the internet that furries are like an infinite well of money and they will spend like three hundred dollars for you to draw like a furry titty and it's like wow and if it's like a pornographic furry titty then holy shit like oh my god what the fuck um then then you'd get even more right the furries pay a lot in porn if Especially weird porn, you could you could make so much money, like a fucking panda shitting on a giraffe. Like that's some serious money. That's what everyone says. And I'm not really ready to like go to that point yet. But I was like, you know what? Okay, I'll look over the requests. And so this guy, he sends me. He's one of many, 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 many people who sent me uh, commission requests that were furries. Um, and he was polite. Don't don't get me wrong, but he was like, hey. Can you draw draw my character? Yada yada, and I'm like, uh, let me let me look at it. <sighs> and so I look at it, and it's I'm not gonna out who it is, cause you know that I think it's illegal because I did solicit him to email me about this, just people to email me about their their commission requests. So I think anyway, um. But he goes, as you can see, it's largely based on uh, a donkey. 
and I'm looking at it, and, like, if I were to show you the picture and go, what animal is this largely based on, donkey would not be in the top 20. Like, it was, it was not a donkey. But I was like, you know what? You want me to draw it? Like, I don't really do furry stuff. And he's like, that's fine. Just draw it, like, realistically. And I'm like, okay. I, I can, I can draw realistic shit. I, I, I can try, right? So... I'm drawing it, and I'm just mumbling to myself, and I, I don't even realize that I am for the first little bit, and then I realize that I'm, I'm actually, at a certain point, shouting, this isn't a donkey. Like, I just keep getting louder and louder, and I'm, I'm just, the upstairs neighbors are getting concerned, and I'm just like, it's not a donkey, it's not a donkey, it's not a donkey, it's not a donkey, this, this is not a fucking donkey, it's fucking dragon bad, it's not a donkey, it's, Donkey's not involved in this, and it just kept getting on and on and on and on and on and on and on like that, and it's just at a certain point I was like, "Look, dude, I don't think I can do this." I sent that to like a couple of different people, and it's just like, <sighs> so I contacted some other artists, and I was like, "Someone else take this. I'm sorry. Like you, you guys, you got anyone else want to deal with the the furry stuff? I mean, I know it's." It's supposedly good money, but like, fuck, dude. And instead, now I'm drawing like corpses and stuff. But whatever, people, I, I'm fine with that. I'm I'm drawing like an entire tarot deck's worth of corpses. Like that's that's fine with me. Not pornographic. It's not gear or gyre or what. One of those is a weird like sandwich thing, kind of taco, and the other one is like a. No, get out of here with the fucking maid cafe. This is not acceptable. Um, I haven't been following the plot. I just knew that we were going to a, a maid cafe with this blue squirrel fuck. Um. Do I actually have to get answers correctly? Like, do I actually have to be paying attention to those questions? <sighs> Fucking... I don't care. I do not care about your troubles, woman. Just serve me a fucking coffee and get out of my face. This Troy will affect the flow of the story. Okay. I gotta give it props, like, the amount that is involving titties in this is, like, 90% less than something like Sakura Spirit or whatever. Like, this, like, this is clearly not, like, a, a, a pornographic furry game, which could totally fucking exist and probably does. Um, I don't even know why it's, like, a probably. It does exist. It has to. Um, but... Yeah, so that's that's why I don't do furry art, and and honestly, I think it's kind of a, a misnomer, or not a misnomer. It's a fuck it. You guys can forgive me for not wording anymore. Um, it, 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 I I don't think that the furries actually pay that much more than whatever whoever else, right? Because. How many artists do you think that are also furries exist? Like, the, there's a market of people who just, they don't, they don't mind. They don't care. Like, you can't jack up the price because of that. Like, th there's an entire group of people who draw furry art because they are furries and enjoy the aesthetic. So, those people are raking in all that cash. Like, you want to, you want your panda shitting on a giraffe? Fuck it, dude. Do it. You know? Why not? You know? But... I don't think that's real. I don't think that's real that, that furries pay more. Maybe I'm just thinking that because I want to justify why I'm giving up that much money, but... WHY ARE YOU A WEEB?! Wow. Did I murder someone? Heterochromia is fine in character design. It's totally acceptable. It's totally acceptable not to have neon involved in your character as well. Like, you can... 
That just... No, stop this. You're killing the run. So is this like the Matrix, or is this like... Uh, Turtles in Time, where they go back in time to, like, the, the, like, samurai era, and they're samurai, and they are able to speak English with the samurai, or whatever, or, I, you know, it's, it's been a while since I've watched Turtles in Time, so, like, if I, if I fuck up the plot or the canon of Turtles in Time, give me a, give me a break, but, um, I was, like, I, that came out in like 92 or something like I was like four give me a fucking break but anyway um is it sort of a combination of those things plus like a rave please fade quicker I mean wh what's great about this is this is a game that probably no one else is trying to speed run right so uh, again I probably have the world record regardless of what I fucking do Yes, Morpheus, get the fuck out of here! I'm trying to play the game and you're slowing it down. Your time slowing down shit is bullshit. Get out of here. Get out. Get out of here with your smug ass face. He seems mad at my disobedience. I don't fucking care. I don't know. Do you ever... This is a problem I used to have as a kid when I'd play a game that you just... You're so not enjoying the game that... I don't care. What is the option to say I don't fucking care about the arc? Do you ever play a game that... Um, it's not just like it's bad. It's like it actually makes you like realize how mortal you are. That, like, every moment that you spend playing it is a moment that is taken from your life and that you can no longer have. That, like, you are only allowed to be here on this this mortal coil for so many years, so many moments. And, and some of it is being used playing this shit game. And you keep playing it, and it's just sort of like... You realize your mortality fully and, and completely that you could be doing anything else you could be going out I could be going outside I could be standing in the sunlight and enjoying the the rays of, of a burning star that will soon die like me but instead here I am playing this furry shit but let's be real have you seen me before I am so fucking pale that there is no goddamn chance that I will ever see the sun again like I, I would if given a chance if like I didn't have to if I wasn't I don't have to speed run furry games. What am I talking about? I could do anything else with my time. But why am I doing this? Why the fuck am I talking to a lion right now? How long is this fucking game? You've made me save like eight times so far, and I've saved in different slots every time. Your your nose makes no sense, Rudolph. Get the fuck out of here. Like that is that is a poor survival situation. How would you evolve to have that You would not evolve to have a red nose. Or neon. Oh no! This is just the first fucking chapter! Holy shit, fuck! No! No! Hold on, no, hold on, hold on. All achievements. There are 134 achievements, I've only completed 14. How many chapters are there? What? 10! Okay, I can do this. No one else is trying to speedrun this. The amount of time I just lost there is inconsequential. I don't know if you guys could see me looking at the, the Steam page thing for it, but... Okay, so if they're all about this long and I spent probably like 30 minutes, 15 minutes, how long have I been here? Has this been an hour yet? <sighs> I... 
I'm not, first name, last name? Yep, that's my name. Don't wear it out. Ashton, answer the questionnaire honestly. I'm just gonna, this. Who the fuck knows what ending I'm going for? Can the text speed e e any faster? I'm just gonna keep clicking, I need some coffee. And fucking Rudolph, why couldn't you have spelled your name with a C rather than a K? Get out of here. Get out of here. Get get out of here. <laughs> Sorry, just needed to get that out. Um... You are a doctor! Have clothes on! Oh... You're a, a rocker, I assume, so you have an excuse, but you're a fucking doctor! That is... That is not proper procedure, and that lab coat will do fucking nothing for you if you... Are you... Why are we... Put on a fucking shirt, both of you, and don't come back! Leave me alone. And his name is Singe. And his name is Rocker! You are so one-dimensional, you're named after your occupation. When your parents were naming you as a child, you were named after the, the, the thing that you were going to do. Every day, you were made fun of in school because you were named Rocker. Everyone's like, oh, do you play music? No. Do you play music? No. At some point, he's got to be like, fuck it, I've got to play music or everyone will give me shit. And this guy's name is Singe because he's a dragon. That's like naming a human piss because they can pee. Why? No, I don't fucking care. Why are you not wearing a shirt? That is not acceptable clothing! I just was giving this game praise because it's not titties! as a main thing, but it's just like they intentionally put the tits above the fucking box line so you can see them at all times. Both of you would die in the wild. You especially, because you stand out like a sore fucking thumb. And I will not believe that you died the inside of your ear. That's fucking weird. I need to calm down. Close my eyes. Pretend like this isn't happening. <sighs> well, it's a lot more enjoyable if I'm not looking at it. I mean, the downside is if there's a, ever a point where I actually need to look and choose an option and I'm not clicking on the right spot. But I imagine I would stop hearing the thump noise of text flying by. Um, so you guys actually know more about this game than I do now because I just sort of... Um, Blacked out. Um, done with the fucking second chapter get out of here Morpheus get the fuck out of here 
Do you have to complete a speed run for, like, to be considered, like, a full speed run? Like, just, like, you know how there's, like, 100% runs and, like, you know, just, like, any percent run? Like, it assumes that you beat the game, right? That's a part of it, right? But what I'm asking is, can I just fucking stop? Like, can I just do a any percent chapter two run? Like chapters one, two, two. Is that a thing I could do? I mean, I make the fucking rules because no one else is speedrunning this shit. So, I mean, I guess... What fucking time is it? I have shit to do today. Okay. I've got... I've got basically, like, another hour. So as long as this game takes l oh fuck off, fuck off! I can suddenly smell bleach and my side hurts. Ah! Are they resurfacing the tubs again downstairs? It smells like chlorine. That's what it is. It's not bleach. It's chlorine. They took out the tub. They took out the tub, or the, the, not tub, the fucking pool. We had a pool at this apartment complex. But then they decided that instead, they're gonna have a fire pit. Now let me explain to you how dumb it is to have a fire pit. It's as dumb as me speedrunning a fucking furry game, okay? Oh my god, get out of here, Barra Bear. Get out of here, get out, get, leave my screen! I've had a lot of caffeine today. It was probably not a good idea to have a lot of caffeine right before this. Anyway. They got rid of, um, the pool to make a fire pit in Texas. Right? Do you know how many days we have a quote-unquote burn ban? A day where if you burn something, you will be arrested because the flames can fly for miles and set something on fire, and then the entire fucking highway's on fire, and people die? All the fucking time we have that! It's goddamn Texas! Another reason why I'm so pale is because fuck going outside, man. Fuck going outside. Fuck sun. Fuck summer. Fuck days where it's warm out. Fuck every day in Texas. It's so hot. It's fucking fall now, right? It just turned fall, like, at some point recently. I'm not totally sure what day fall actually changed over, but whatever. Anyway. It's like fucking, how hot is it today? I'm, I'm gonna look at the temperature instead. Because it's been a proven fact that you guys do like to hear about what the weather is on random days in my life. So, it's 82 today in Fahrenheit for Americans. Uh, for uh, people anywhere else in the world, it's 28 degrees Celsius. It's fall. It's fucking fall. Like, 82 is, is comfortable love weather, but I'm not gonna... I mean, it's better. It's actually not that bad. That's actually kind of pleasant. Get out of here, Bar Bear. No. Oh, why? He's my right-hand man, so his name is Righty. I just got an achievement, right-hand man. The smell of chlorine has gone away. But yeah, so I don't know why I would be smelling chlorine. I just... I don't think we have any bleach in the apartment. Like, there's no reason to. Like, it's such a small apartment, you will kill people with it. Um, so, I I'm gonna take a stab at what the plot is, because I'm only sort of paying attention. Um... It seems to me that there is a secret society uh, run by Morpheus that is in the present and the past. And in the present, we are in Japan and a maid cafe. But in the past, yeah, I have to assume this is a different universe because, like, this is not acceptable in any universe where maid cafe... I mean, 
I guess on a furry universe it could be. Whatever, fuck it. But anyway, we're in, in fantasy times, right? And, um... That, the, the, the things that are happening with the, the king or the queen or whatever that dog was that wears the Egyptian outfit, um... They... Something happened, and now we have to fix it. And I don't know if we went back in time or if, what. Um... I just got a notification that I have a dentist appointment. Shit's gonna have to wait. I'm, I'm talking to a bear. And I don't think I have dental coverage. But whatever. How are you fucking here? How are you here in the past? Meanwhile, on Earth... What? Everyone needs to put on a fucking shirt. It's like really fucked up, because here's the deal. So Dante over here, shock, excuse me. Um, it's like the whole thing with like Donald Duck. Like when he takes off his shirt, it gets really weird. You're like, holy fuck, he's naked. But he's had his dick out the entire fucking time. Like he never, he, ne he doesn't wear pants, right? But he'll still cover up his dick. He'll, like, put his hands so that way you can't see his dick. But it's like, your dick's been out this entire time, dude. Like, I don't just walk outside with my dick out. And not get arrested. But it's like that in this universe. But instead, everyone just doesn't wear shirts. Also, that's not where your tits would be if you were a... If you were a dog. Like, they'd be, like, all up and down her body. She would have like just... Fuck it. We gotta make it look somewhat human. Just put a dog head on a woman's body. Give it a tail. Make it furry. Cover it in hair. Make it neon. Different colored eyes because whatever. Also, this song. That. Awful, awful song. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Whoever made this game, you are serving a very specific community and you're doing very well in what you're doing. I'm sure. I haven't read your game. And I'm probably giving it too hard of a time. You know what? This shit gets people through days, you know? People come and watch my stuff because it gets them through a fucking day, you know? Like, you have a good time, you watch, you have a good laugh. It makes you just have have fun with life and, you know, just a little bit of sideline entertainment. Yeah, the same shit. This is, this is exactly the kind of shit that other people enjoy. Other people enjoy this. You can enjoy this game and also enjoy me. If you are one of those people, I, I honestly want to know. Kind of, because it's just like... Fucking... I feel really bad any time that I like go after like a sub-community like furries or whatever. It's just like, you know what? It gets them through the fucking day, and as long as they're not throwing it in other people's faces, you're being a dick about it or whatever. It's whatever, you know? It's the same sort of shit with metalheads. Like, you know, as long as you're not forcing everyone to, like, know the difference between, like, thrash metal and death metal, it's like, you know what? Whatever. Like, I don't know how this is different than Anthro versus... There's some other one where it's like furries, but they're not human looking someone don't try that telltale shit with me game um you know it gets someone through the day it's killing me but someone is very happy to see uh 
this fucking squirrel. What is the squirrel's name? Uh, the shocker. Conrad, right? Is that Conrad? One thing that Steam needs to fix is when you get a game, when you're gifted a game, it needs to say that you were gifted it and not that you bought it or that you just own it now. Ambiguously, you own this game now. Like, it would be great if it explained where you got it. Like, Rev was gifted this game by someone via email. You know? So that way it doesn't look like I fucking bought this game. That'd be, that'd be pretty cool, honestly. I have to to just go back to Sakura, whatever, fucking... They're shorter. I mean, this is a fucking long game. If you enjoy what you're seeing, like, if you enjoy the plot, if you're, like, slowing it down to half speed, if you slow this video down to half speed, you might be able to read everything. Excuse me. Um, and you're enjoying this, like, it's, it's probably good value for however much it fucking costs. What is... I'm gonna check. Got my phone out. Pro strats. Because it doesn't seem like hitting multiple buttons does fuck all. It's honestly just... It makes me feel better. I don't think I'm actually going any faster by pressing enter. Do you? Wait a minute. Holding down enter. It goes slightly faster, doesn't it? Fuck. Okay. Speedrun strats have, 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 have been adapted. I can hold down the inner on the right side while I use my phone with my left hand. Uh, how much is this game? How much did someone spend? It's 40% off as of this recording, which makes it six bucks. So that's, it's normally 10 bucks. I mean, if this is your jam, man, like this is, this is a long ass game. It's a long ass 10 hours of, of, of Matrix Fantasy Maid Cafe genre mishmash. I don't think the Matrix has ever been in a, like, I don't think that's ever been like a genre, uh, combination that's ever been done before prior to this. The Matrix and Maid Cafes and Fantasy and, and Furries. Like, that's a very niche market of someone who would enjoy all of those things. But I, I feel like they, they know their audience, you know? They know that this design of Conrad... This is Conrad. What the fuck is a squirrel? Why are furries always, like, kind of normal-ish animals? Like, you know, okay. They're like... A fox, a wolf. Wolves are very popular. Um, uh, rabbits. Squirrels are kind of rare. I'll give it. I'll give this game credit. Like I've never seen a squirrel furry before. Um, <sighs> like props to you for for throwing in a squirrel when you could add an, yet another fox. But what about, um, what about the, uh, fucking skunk wolf? Or, um, uh, the, uh, like, ocelotl? Or, um, is that a, is that a type of weapon or is that an animal? I forget. Um, weird animal. Let me just Google that shit. Weird. What's a weird-ass animal that you've never heard of? Uh, the Dumbo Octopus, Pink Fairy Armadillo, Star Nose Mole. Um, this is, this is some website that, that talks about it. Dumbo Octopus Furries, where are you at? Um, I'm looking at this page. Pink Fairy Armadillo, I-I? Yeah, is there an I-I? The Maned Wolf. 
Uh, I don't know how you'd tell that from, like, Morpheus over here. But, um, the tuft deer. A dick dick! Is anyone a dick dick furry? It's spelled D-I-K. Not- d get your heads out of the gutters, okay? Um, it's like a tiny deer. A pika! What about a pika? You guys know what a fucking pika is? It's spelled like pika, like Pikachu. I think it was the basis of Pikachu. It's like this- it's the size of a tennis ball, right? I did a report on it once for school. It's the size of a tennis ball, but it's like pound for pound the loudest animal in existence because you can hear it from miles away. And it just shrieks. They live in the mountains, they can eat poisonous flowers, and they use it as a defense mechanism. They make their nests out of, like, poison flowers, and then they just fucking scream. It's the weirdest fucking thing, and aside from, like, the screaming thing, they're pretty adorable. Like, they're just go, Wah! It's not like that, actually. It's more of a Meow! sound, but, you know, um... But they're cute, otherwise, look it up, Pika. Um, pikas, pika furries. Where you at, Max? I guess Max is a. Uh, that's fine. Whatever. That that's a that's a name. An erwadi dolphin, the gurnik. What the fuck is a gurnik? Wow, that is fucking horrifying. It's like a long-nosed deer. Oh, good. We're on to chapter four. Uh, the dugong, the barbarusa, lampreys. Is there a lamprey furry? Like, you gotta have something that's, like, somewhat, like... You can, like, appreciate its aesthetic. The lamprey is not really, like... The fulsa, the star-nosed mole, Sudna Kolgo. Kolgo. What the fuck is that? It's kinda cute. It's like, uh, I don't know what the fuck that is. It's got these beady, just inky black eyes with the face of a squirrel. And they bulge out of its head a little bit. And then it's got like this kind of, um, reddish brown fur. Not like this fuck over on the right here. Uh, but like kind of like a normal creature fur with like little white spite spots. And it looks like it's kind of small. It's kind of, uh, uh, cute. The Yeti crab. It's like a furry, fuzzy crab. Superb burb, bird of paradise. That's that's pretty good. The blobfish. I'm just looking at random clickbait articles now. I'm not even paying attention to this fucking game anymore. All right. Well, there's that. Ever look this? Ever look yourself up? This site is addicting. Enter your name, and the results will surprise you. You know what happens when you look up my name? You find my art website. Going full circle back to that Killa. Killa is his name. Not to be confused with Ghostface Killa. I think if you did that, you'd get shot. So are we in Japan or like. So this cog. This cog symbol, Morpheus had it as well. Uh, is that important? Like, is that the sign of the Ark? So this guy's a cop, because he's wearing a, a, a bulletproof jacket and looks like a cop. But I don't know how many stripes that is. Like, I don't know what that makes him. Does that make him, like... Military ranks have always kind of confused me. Rook, you just... I don't like him. I don't like his face. Do you know what I mean? <sighs> this game has significantly more choices than Sakura Spirit. In that we've had to make at least two within the first couple of seconds of it. Um, so that that's, that's going for it. I think we've been introduced to all the characters now. So I don't think I can be shocked by anything that's going to happen. Like, we're not going to have... Um, if I say no, actually, if I say no, I can speed up because I don't have to do an extra prompt of saving. 
I mean, it will mean that we'll never be able to come back to this point in the game, which I know, I know, if this fucking computer crashes and I lose my progress, I will scream for hours. Um... Because I had to put up with this, you know? I assume there are not death states. Yes, it's fine, whatever. Fucking, it's fine. Yes. Get out of here, Dr. Fuck. Dr. Dick, where do I know that name from? Oh, it's because Flash games. I used to play a lot of Flash games. and Dr. Dick's not a Flash game, but there was always like the, the cartoon for Dr. Dick. And you just kind of get a chuckle out of Dr. Dick. Coffee and not pay attention. It smells like pizza. Like Gaddyland pizza. I don't know why. Why is my why does my coffee smell like Gaddyland pizza? Like good it's not great coffee i put some creamer in it today because i wanted to kind of spice up my life normally i don't put creamer or sugar or anything in my coffee but um we got this creamer it's like really sweet vanilla and it, it, it you know it's it's a little bit something special get me through a day you know it's a, it's it's what a lot of this is about getting you through a day you know, play a furry game, get through a day, drink some coffee with a little bit of creamer in it so you can deal with the furry game. Get through a day, watch a stupid video on the internet, get through a day. It's the fucking way it works, man, but like, for some reason today it smells like Gaddy Land. Like Gaddy, Gaddy's Pizza. Is that just an American thing? Imagine cardboard as pizza. It's, it's not good. But you can treat, like, 20 kids to, like, all the pizza they can eat for, like, five bucks or some shit like that. Like, it's... And kids, they don't give a fuck. Like, it's pizza, you know? Like, have you ever heard a kid complain about pizza? Even the pizza at school, you're kind of like, yeah, that's fine. Like, it... Like, elementary school pizza? You're like, yeah, all right. Also, yes, I know that pizza is considered a vegetable in America. I don't fucking know why. Actually, I do. It's because they decided that they needed to have a full balanced meal for kids at schools. So Congress decided that the, the fact that, or I think it was Congress, you know what, I don't fucking know or care. But anyway, they decided that pizza was a vegetable because vegetable was involved in it, right? Your response validates a Claire. Well, I feel glad that a Claire is validated. Her hope is shut down. Okay. So anyway, they decided it was pizza. Um, there's a place, there's actually a farm that specialty is making pizza. All they do is make all of the ingredients for a traditional pizza on site. So you literally just go and get all of the stuff for pizza there. It's pretty cool. Um, never been. I was just looking up weird Wikipedia articles the other day, so I'd have something to talk about in case. And she is! She is involved with Morpheus! You guys, like... Related? Brother-sister? Dating? Both? What- what is this? 
Are you just both in the same organization? How long does it take you to get into this jacket every morning? Like, this jacket, like, you've got to lace that shit up every fucking day? God damn. You know, if you're a furry, do you clean yourself with a shower or do you clean yourself with a- WHO THE FUCK ARE YOU?! Sorry. I know you, the Neopet motherfucker on the right here, but like, who is this fuck on the left? Have we seen them before or did I just forget? You don't need to wear a dog collar! You're the highest thing up on the food chain because you're a furry, like, that's how it works in this universe. Like, humans don't exist, animals evolved to... ...build maid cafes. Why the fuck would they do that? But you don't need to wear a fucking... You don't need to wear a fucking choker, or like, a, a collar like that. Like, you're in prison. He's not wearing one. It's not required by the prison. Like, Caitlyn has just decided upon herself that she, she, he, they want one. It's not necessary. You don't need to be like this. Why are you like this? I need to stay calm. It's just the caffeine talking, man. It's just the caffeine talking. It's okay. It's okay. Just deep breaths. Slow fade. Get out of here. Why does the Wayfarer's Tavern look like a, a Home and Gardens catalog stock photo? I didn't realize that's where we were. I thought, so is the Wayfarer Tavern in the present or in the, the past or is it in the Matrix? I mean, I, I don't actually care enough to like look up the plot or whatever. I might look it up after we're done, like, look up a, um, a plot summary so I could take a guess. Because I'm, I'm curious to know if I got that right, that the Matrix is involved. It's called the Ark instead of the Matrix, but, like... Okay, you are fucking new. Get the fuck out! I don't need you. I've got enough bullshit characters that I've got to deal with. Like, my brain is able to comprehend only so many things before it just stops wanting to fucking care. Bonus. So that, that, that that's a, that's a dude. That's, Velasquez is a king, right? And then we've got Dusk. Okay. So, I'm betting that Velasquez is, is good because Dusk looks too soft to be evil. We're back in the arc again. Did you just open up a separate fucking window to- is, is this, okay. She's thinking now. That's how we know. <sighs> I'm gonna drink the rest of my coffee here. So these are these are most definitely stock photos. Wait a minute, I can just hold down left click. I don't even need to be clicking. Wow, that makes things really easy. And then if I see an option, I just have to click. Huh. 
Now if I just hover it about here, I think this is where the save game yes no option is. And I think this is no, or it might be yes, I don't know. Can I click the side buttons? Does that make it... I can't tell if the, the side buttons are making it go faster. Like, it doesn't seem like it does. No. If I hold down two inner buttons at the same time, does that work too? No. It, it, it's the same speed no matter what I do. So just holding down left click, because I was holding down, I was tapping left click and then holding down inner. Maybe I wasn't, was I clicking that entire time or was I not? What's with the Pidgeotto haircut, dude? Like, why do you gotta be like that? What is this? Like, why is that? That's like a style now. Like, dudes with like a Pidgeotto sort of thing going on. And it's just like, fucking don't. I got my haircut recently and the woman, she was really, really nice. Um, very Korean, could not understand anything that I was saying and I couldn't understand anything that she was saying. She said, she asked me if, my name was English if Colin was an English name I said well you know technically it's Irish but you know yeah and she's like oh and I think that's how she saw at some point she got it into her head that I was Irish um and she was wondering if I'd ever been to Ireland and what it was like there and I've never been outside the states so I don't know and I mean she's she was very nice I tipped her like 30% rather than my normal 20% for a haircut but like um, it was very confusing, because I didn't know what the fuck was going on. I'm not going to try and imitate her accent, because that would be really racist, and I, I really couldn't do it in a way that wasn't, wouldn't be racist. But, you know, she liked my beard. That deserves a 30% tip. I mean, that's just gripping information for you guys, I know. Like, you guys are here... To hear about the time that I once got my hair cut by a woman and we had a misunderstanding about whether or not it was from Ireland or not. And she told me about this movie she watched. Which is also exciting for you guys to hear about. Um, and she didn't say the name of it, or if she did, I didn't understand. Um, best haircut I've had in a while, though. To be honest. Like, the last couple of times I've gotten a haircut, it was shit. I don't know why I'm clicking. I'm just forced to have it now. Um, I don't think I could ever, like, do the YouTuber thing where I, like, get a weird haircut and dye it a weird color. Like, maybe for a charity thing I'd dye my hair, and I think that's where most of the, the people who do YouTube dye their hair whatever color they dye it. But, like... I like easy to do hairstyles. Like this hairstyle I've got right now like looks good regardless if I put gel in my hair in the morning or not. Just kind of mess it around. Because if I roll out of bed and just like bolt out the door, I still look like I've got messy hair and it, it's great. It's just more stylized if I actually try. Um, so it's like, cool. That's that's my speed, man. I don't want something I have to comb or, or, or take care of. like. That just... It's too much extra work, man. I got too much shit to do. Like, I, I gotta make sure my beard looks good. Don't get me wrong. My beard has to look on point. But, um... But, like, the hair on the top of my head, like, as long as I'm not balding or whatever, like, I'm fine. Whatever. I tried to have a mohawk once. It didn't work out. Um... I don't think I could do it ever again. I, I've talked about it on stream that I could just have, like, Liberty Spike mohawk thing going on. But I think that would be so outrageously out of character for me that people would just be like, what the fuck? Um, what, so what is, um, what is, uh, squirrel fuck over here do? Like, what is his job? Cause like, first thing he does when he takes first name, last name, like on their tour of Tokyo is take them to a maid cafe, right? So like. Let the games begin, is the achievement I just got. <sighs> a 
Okay, Velasquez is is might be evil. No way, getting stabbed. Okay, we're on chapter six of ten. Or eleven. I mean it's kinda unclear. It goes up to nine and then there's an epilogue, so I guess it would be ten, yeah? I don't know why I thought it would be eleven. I can just lean back. Kind of just fall asleep. I mean, I'm obviously not playing this game in, like, the intended way. Speedrunning a, um, a furry visual novel is not what's intended, but... I'm taking this game in, like, sprints, you know? Like, it, the game keeps going regardless if I'm left-clicking or if I'm... God, I fucking hope I restarted my recording for the audio, because otherwise this is just going to be, like, dead air. Because how I did this was, just in case if I just start screaming, I decided I would um, have a separate audio just for uh, myself, and then I have the game audio going using the streaming program, so that way I can, like... record it because I'm too lazy to find out another recording program that I could use. Um, these fade ins and outs, like if there's a way to speed past them, like it'd be very easy to beat my time. But as far as I could tell, there was no option menu to make this game go faster. There's no scene select. There's none of that. It's just like you save your progress in the visual novel somewhere along the way. And then um, that's how you progress through it faster. Can you do that in a, a speed run? Just have a, I mean, generally speaking, you do have to, like, go from the beginning, yeah. There are exceptions to, like, where the end ends up being, but, like, the beginning is always, like, the start screen, yeah? At two, Killa? Did you just... Anyway. Um, yeah. Um... Uh, Wait, I thought this dude got stabbed while he was on the altar. What happened? The Fabio horse is kind of freaking me out, I'm not gonna lie. What do jackals actually look like? I've only ever seen, like, you know, like... Recreations of, like, Egyptian drawings of jackals. But what does a jackal actually look like? Looks like a, a fox, right? Yeah, like a coyote. No, not, not, not the... Yeah, it just looks like a coyote. That's a fucking coyote. Except for it's a jackal, so it's not. But, you know, we have coyotes here. They're, they, 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 they kind of stay out of the way for the most of the time. Like, they, they, they're scared of humans. If you live out in the middle of nowhere, you don't leave your cats outside or else they'll fucking eat them. Um, sorry if that was, like, out of nowhere for you guys, but the, it's true. You gotta, if you live in the country, you can't have your, your animals out at night because you'll, they'll die straight up. Um... You know, I'm thinking about it. Um, at this point, furries have been so over-designed that if you just went with, like, a basic bitch furry design, no one would, like, remember it. Like, you have to do something really outrageous, like blue hair, red stripe across the nose, blue strike that perfectly matches up with this color line. Like, you have to do something like that, yeah? Like, that's just how furry art has evolved into being what it is.
I'm gonna go play something good after this. Just something to, like, calm myself the fuck down. You know, he could be a mouse, but I figure with that tail, he's- Rook has to be an otter, doesn't he? He's just- he's just a straight-up otter, right? It's almost over. I think- I like how it says that she took the tablet from him, but like... It's still in his hands because they only have, like, the one frame because of the visual novel, and that's how visual novels work. Okay, she gave it back to him. The crashing sound is them pausing reality, just... So you know. Back in the Matrix. The Matrix doesn't make cool sounds like... Like, or whatever sounds it made in the Matrix. Again, it's been a while. Don't give me shit. Um, God, it's going to take up so much room on my hard drive. To hold down enter and click because I feel like this is going to be like a lot of questions. A co this conversation was optimal. Okay. I'm sorry, I started off this thing with like so much energy going into the like beginning of it, but then. Hello, first name. Hello, Arkron. So good. <laughs> I love that we just went with first name. It makes me feel so good when they're like, first name, we have to act. Mr. Last Name is here. He's the key to the, 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 the fuck crystal. You must go quickly. Grab hold of your destiny. Enter the Ark. So I just realized that the Ark is like a, a reference to the Bible. Like there's no other Ark that, like you don't talk about like, I'm sorry, if I save, what happens? Oh, if you save, you can only save one of these two. I, you know, actually, of the characters, both, I wouldn't mind dying. The the otter, I'd prefer to have killed, because his smug little face annoys the shit out of me. But, you know, if the squirrel dies, I would not be fucking, um, I'll save Rook, sure. The unbearable gift, killer. Yeah, both of you can go fucking die. Um, if both of them end up dying, that's fine. I was given a choice to save one and not the other. I wonder who the person with the black silhouette that looks like the only person that has that exact silhouette. I mean, good character design, like, the silhouettes are very easy to, like, identify. Like... That's how you know you've made a good character. If, like, you can just have the silhouette of your character and it's, like, indistinguishable from anything else. Like, they're, they're you know, this guy looks different than that guy and so on and so forth. At least within the series of this game, but, like... But that, that has to be Max, right? That's fucking Max. We know this. Or is it... No, that's the fucking owl chick. Isn't it? I'm getting intrigued. I'm not. Um. I mean, if you've got a lot of time in your hand and you want to fucking... If you want something to do and you're an artist, draw first name, last name, the, the lamprey. Like, that, that's a, that's a fucking great for Sona there. God, did I... What's happening? Did the game softlock? No, don't tell me wait! Stop. Just go. 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 
Go! I want this game to end. Stop soft locking. I have to take this game in sprints. If I if I try and like be on point the entire time, I'm just I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna not be able to do it. I just I fucking can't. It's like my yeah. I'd like to save the game. Sure. Um, I'm holding down enter and then just being ready to left click because I feel like my APM would go up by doing that, right? Like because. Wait, no, it actually doesn't... Enter and left-click work differently. So holding down enter speeds along text unless if it has a full stop, in which case that it doesn't do that. Fuck you, game! Have mechanics that are easy for me to, like, exploit, so that way I don't have to play it. Like, Sakura Spirit, that kind of shit, like, it, it, it hurts, it breaks me, but it's over, you know? Like, it ends... It ends so fucking quickly. But this, 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 this fucking shit. Like, I gotta go. I gotta leave. I've gotta, I've got shit to do, man. I can't, I can't be inside all day playing this, this shit. Whatever happened to the fantasy shit? What was going on with that? Is that still happening? What happened to the Barra Bear and the the, the 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 fox wearing fuck all? What happened to the 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 What happened to everyone? I mean, can we just did they blow up? Was that what that bomb was about? Are they all dead? Fuck yes. Next, okay, new rule for me, never doing another visual novel unless if I know exactly how many hours it is to beat. Because, like, Nurse Love, right? That had a very explicit beginning and ending, like, time, you know? It was long. It was like a 30-minute hour long. What the fuck is this overdesigned piece of shit? Okay. Why are there two of them now? Oh fuck, I just screamed and I wasn't looking at the screen. Why are there two of them? I wanted you to die in the bomb. Why are you still here? I fucking can't, guys. I fucking can't do this. <laughs> what act are we on? Please tell me this is the last act. Like, the bomb went off. We Someone had to die. It's like... Game of Thrones shit's rampant. It's not like Game of Thrones. I'm sorry. It's fucking... I want to call him J.R.R. Tolkien, but that's not who made that game. That movie. The, the show. The book. George Martin. Mm. Chapter 7. You know what? I fucking... Mm. Okay. Okay. It ends on chap- I've got 15 minutes before I have to go. No, I, I can- I, I can- I can- I can just- I'll, I'll speed. I, I can fucking speed. I've got 30 minutes, and then I'm gonna have to, like, just scream. And leave. Oh my god, I've been playing this game for, like, two hours. 
she's a fucking griffin. She's not an owl, she's a griffin. Right? Is she an owl or a griffin? She's got the fucking face of a... But, but you, could, you could have arms that were... But she's got... Uh, why would she have four? But I mean, if she's a fucking bird, she would have... I wish I could do that scream that's like right at the beginning of Angel of Death by Slayer. That's like how I'm feeling. Like just internally. Go go look up that song. Angel of Death. By Slayer. They had to They got sued really bad for that. Um song, because it is is not exactly the the friendliest of topics. Um Uh, I, I gotta tell you that that this image here looks really fucking great stretch across my 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 screen is this what what resolution is my screen I've got too many fucking why do you still fucking matter wait rocker is dead you're going to furry hell rocker you are not close enough to Rocker. That's... <sighs> Fine. I should say words because that's what you guys come here for you're not coming here so you can get the intent I thought we killed him I thought like I explicitly picked to kill did I choose the wrong I chose the wrong one You know, there are people who climb Mount Everest, right? I think I've talked about this before. There are people who climb Mount Everest, and fucking why, right? Because it's there, right? That's why they do it. Like, they climb Mount Everest because... Get out of here. They climb Mount Everest because they're rich and they have nothing else to be doing with their time. Because poor people, poor people do not fucking climb Mount Everest, you know it? Like, poor people, like, you gotta have a shit ton of fucking money to climb Mount Everest. Like, if you're gonna be one of those people who dies in a really stupid way on top of a mountain where no one will find your corpse, like, you have to be rich. That is a rich person thing to do. That is a rich person problem to die on Mount Everest, you know? Or you're, like, um, one of the guides, but, like, you know, that, that's different. I don't know. I mean... I wonder if the, like, people who help rich people climb Mount Everest, like, they've got to have a decent amount of money. Because, like, that's basically a suicide mission, right? Get to the top of the Falcon Mountain, they said. You know? It'll be fun, they said. You'll be one of the first, they said. But no, it's been trailblazed by people for years. You're just some rich guy. You're one of the rich people who got to the top of the mountain, right? Anyway. People do it for whatever fucking reason. They climb they climb Mount Everest to do a thing. Because they've got it, right? They've got to they got to prove it to themselves that they're actually worth something for doing it. This is my Mount Everest at this point, you know? Like it's my It's not a rich person way to die playing this. Although I do feel my soul escaping my body every single time I see this fuck. Um, but like, it, it's my, it's my own separate, like, hell. This is the trial that I must take. And that's, that's what they say Mount Everest is about. It's like, you're climbing Mount Everest because you've got to, like, prove it, your, your strength to yourself or whatever fucking bullshit, right?
but like this is not like a um this is an endurance thing I was not prepared for this I feel like I've attempted to climb Mount Everest in my current physical physique again don't go outside much and I'll be fucked if I work out I gotta be real, like, I, I'm pretty much sedentary all of the time. I just kind of, kind of go from one thing to another. And, like, most of the things that I enjoy doing involve me sitting on my ass, you know? I, 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 I do art. I, I stream. I make videos about playing furry games as fast as possible. Like, these are things that I do with my time. Uh, working out, not one of them. It's not a healthy way to live. As you can guess, but like, you know, it's what I do. So, whatever. Fuck it, man. Um. But this does not put me in good physical condition. You know, you should work out. You should exercise. At least get your heart pumping, you know. Eat a fucking apple. I don't know. Um. But. I don't. You know. Before I started this. This. I was going to say stream, but this is a fucking video can't stream this because I wasn't sure if it was gonna have like fucking porn in it or not it doesn't so good um I mean if it's uh, if it's been this long and they're gonna get to the porn now after all of this like it's 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 a little bit late you know it's a little bit late in the game to be pulling out the tits you know you know, some it's not even softcore. Like, they've just got, like, whatever the fuck these two are. Uh, the perspective is off on her nose. Why I'm, I'm, I'm giving a shit about... Perspective in this game. I don't care what happened several months prior. I really don't fucking care. Look at all these friends that we lost along the way, probably because we did something, because we didn't fucking defuse the bomb, the, 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 the fantasy, the whatever. I'm sure that was very touching and very emotional, but... I don't know. I feel like I just tried to do a marathon with no preparation, is what I'm getting at. Like, if I- if I die here in my chair, playing this furry game, you know, and they find my body, and this fuck is on the screen, I'm just laying here, like, please, if you ever hear about me dying in front of my computer and I've got some furry shit up, please, like, look for a recording that I have going and, like, watch the beginning to maybe guess why and what happened to me you know it's like those those audio logs you get in horror games where they're like spread out like 80 tapes across like 50 different locations and they like go in like the toilet pipe and they've got like a, a if you search in the corner you'll find a tape of the guy and he's like audio log number 37 climb down the toilet i have to get away from that thing It'd be like that, except for, you know, with this fuck on the screen instead. Um, you know, just let people know what happened to me. Is this the seed vault? Where are we? That was a thing I read about recently, the seed vault. Um, it's this, um, in case if, like, all of the world gets fucked, and we have to rebuild, like, all of... The plants that exist, we have like seeds stored in a place so that way we can like, you know, get them, get them back. We can regrow a population. It's in like one of those northern, northern countries somewhere in the Europe area ish. I, I want to say Norway, but I don't think that's right. 
my bond with Rook was strong enough. We actually give a fuck about this dude? Like, this is the guy that we were close enough to. Not the rocker, not the cop, but this fuck. God damn it. I don't need to click. Where am I clicking? Holding down. I'm holding down inner. That's just fine. Have you heard of Aglo New York? I've been reading weird Wikipedia articles. I was talking about this a minute ago. Aglo New York does not exist. It's, it's literally just a copyright tool. So if you're making a map, right? You want to make it. You spent all this time. You've gone to all these places. You've you've drawn out the little lakes and the streams and the roads and all of that shit. And that takes for fucking ever, right? But you don't want someone like just copying down your map and being like, "Oh yeah, this is mine. How can you prove it's not?" Right? So they came up with this fake town. A couple of maps have it, right? And it's this fake town in New York called Aglau or something like that. Look it up. Just spell it like algae, but with like. No understanding of how to spell. Sort of like how these people spell their names in this game. Like, you could spell Chris with, like, a, a, a CH, but you've decided to spell it with, like, an X somehow. Um, it's sort of like that. Um, anyway. Anyway, this town doesn't exist. It's literally just there, so that way if someone wants to check and see if you just copied their map, they can just look for where that map was, and then they can just say, Oh, you copied our map, because, um... Aglo doesn't exist, and if you put it on your map, then you clearly copied our map. Literally wanting to talk about anything other than this. If you had a first sono, would you really want them to be in fish na nets and like stockings? Oh god, I've bonded with the the. S is it goth or scene? What's the difference? Like scene is like the neon goth, right? It's very similar. It's more of a hot topic goth than a um. Than like a um. Misfits gr digging up bones, kind of got something weird going on, or you're trying to act like you've got something weird going on, but just like nothing's going on in your life. Like, scene, like y you can be happy, right? Like, goth, you have to be like kind of like miserable looking, but like, scene, you look like you're about to go to a rave. That's the difference, right? So, this is like kind of this is more goth. Uh, see, the thing about being homeschooled is you don't have these, like, cliques. They just didn't exist, right? So, the, you know, I had the homeschooling group that I, I went to, but there were, like, five or six other kids there, right? So, like, you didn't have to, like, really stand out, like, by being the, you know, in the goth clique or whatever. Like, you were just, like, there, you know? Your standing out was just you existing, you know? Like... You hung out with the people that you like to hang out with, or you didn't, you know? If you didn't like the group, you didn't go to the group, you know? Um, so, like, we didn't really have goth or scene kids, so I, I don't really have that, like, understanding. That's the thing that, like, when I was on DeviantArt, which, you know, because that's the progression of an artist in, you know, this year, this decade... You know, this generation, like, you had your DeviantArt age. Fucking get over it. Everyone did, if you did art. Like, LiveJournal and fucking DeviantArt and MySpace, and if you weren't, like, if I wasn't, like, one of your top friends, like, shit, man. They, what a fucked up system that was for MySpace to have. That, like, certain people wouldn't be... Like, I had to have my brother in, like, the top five or else, like, that would be an issue. But then he got over it because, like, he didn't want to have to deal with that. And he wanted to make sure his girlfriend at the time was his number one. 
because they had this ranking system. So, so though, for those of you that weren't around, MySpace was like Facebook, but shittier. Um, how it works is that like you had your your friends, but they were ranked. Like there were, but only like your top five, I think it was, or was it top eight? It's been it's been a while. It's been a couple decades. <laughs> it's been a fucking decade. Um, um, if you weren't in their top eight, you wouldn't show up on their page when you like logged on, and people would get fucking pissed if like they weren't in your top eight anymore or whatever it was. And it was it was it was some serious shit. Friendships were broken. Because of this, man. Like, fucking... People got mad. And they... People broke up. What is that bitch doing in your top five? You know? Got him. I don't fucking care, Rio. This is like a full ass fucking like two hour experience. This is like This is a fucking movie. There are movies shorter than this. What time is it? Oh my god. I've gotta go soon. What what fucking act are we on? Like, I've gotta go pick up Tilda from from class, right? How am I gonna explain this shit, right? I gotta go like get her. Like, but if I finish this game out, like, I'm gonna have to explain, you know, oh, you know, why were you late? Oh, I'm sorry, I had to finish out the furry game because Morpheus was going on a fucking rant about whatever and he had to fade away slowly. Please be, please be over. Please be over. Killa, I don't fucking care about you. I literally, between a choice between you and someone else, I picked the other person, you died, and I... Still couldn't give a fuck. Please say that I don't care. Your bond with Killa was strong enough. Fuck! I didn't care about the squirrel! Is that why he popped up so much? Because I had conversations with him where he was... Fucking in the thing and we saved him from furry hell. I don't want to save killer from furry hell. He can go to hell for all I care God it's gonna be awkward if I end up in hell Eddie. Wait, why is your name Eddie now? I thought your name was Killa. Why the fuck is your name Eddie? Is your name Eddie or Killa? How long have you been lying to me, bitch? Goodbye, first name. Has anyone done like a let or a uh, speed run in multiple sections? Is this Boxy's persona? Is Boxy? No one knows. I feel like we've come a very far distance with this, like emotionally and spiritually. We've gone a lot of places with this game. I haven't been reading it or really giving a fuck. How are you surprised that it's him? How many people look like that? Okay, we're fine. Um... I mean, we've talked about MySpace and haircuts and and, um, goth culture, furries, how far you're willing to go to make a paycheck. Um,
But you're not really allowed to, in a speedrun, just save, stop, and come back, so I have to fucking finish this. Holy fuck. Do I text her and be like, hold on, I'm fucking playing a furry game, I'll get you in a minute? This game has to end in the next six minutes or I'm going to be seriously late. No. Just... N nothing. Please, 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 please die. Everyone just please die. So were these OCs or were these just like, was this like a kickstarted thing? What is the story behind this game? There's a story behind this game. There has to be. You can't just fucking do this. You can't just fucking make this and not have a story behind why you've done this. You know, this fox reminds me of the fucking, um, fox from Five Nights at Freddy's. Like, everyone wants to fuck that thing. Like, when I was looking for, like, I did this video a while back that was like, um, you know, fan-made games and bootlegs of Five Nights at Freddy's. And fucking, like, you see some weird shit when you're on that journey. Like, um, oh, did I choose Sam? Fuck. Um... So we gotta look at fox titties for the next five minutes. I feel like I have to play this out to the end now. Fidget. I can you tell that rabbits don't blush? Do I know you? Do I fucking know you? The longest journey achievement. It certainly is. Anyway, people are into some fucking weird shit. Cause like, have you ever thought about like fucking a car engine? I'm just saying, like, that's what it would be like to try and fuck Foxy from Five Nights at Freddy's, right? It'd be like fucking a fuck, like a, a fucking diesel engine. And why are we in this bedroom? Is this a bedroom? Are we about to fuck Morpheus? My bond with whoever the fuck Morpheus is strong enough. Okay, good. I'm glad there were besties or whatever. Stuck on repeat. Please just end this. Morpheus, just... Just fucking... Fucking into me, Morpheus. I'm begging you. How is this game this fucking long? What chapter are we on? We've got to be coming near the end of this, right? It's got to be almost. No. We're at chapter eight of like 10. Who the fuck are you? Stop this! We are like fucking two hours into this shit at full speed. You cannot be introducing another fucker. Fuck you! God damn it. I don't fucking care about your character progression. I don't care about any of these characters' progressions. You are holding your cards backwards. You're a shit magician. Fuck you.
Is he the guard? Do they just have like a fucking kids party magician hanging out outside to protect them? I like how it says this choice will affect the plot of the story. So like nothing else you choose will matter in this. Oh, the final steps. This is an achievement. The final steps. It's almost over. It's almost over. Shitty ass party magician guarding the king. This is why people get murdered. If I was a fucking king, I would not have a goddamn party magician guarding my fucking. Like, he's a magician, yeah? That's not the same thing as a fucking, like, Merlin magician, right? There's a different kind of magician. Like, that's a. That's a. No. Chapter 10 The Future We Fuck. This is the last one, yeah? This is the last fucking chapter where it's almost over? I'm gonna check the Steam page, so just whatever's happening on screen's happening. Oh my god, end of the line. It's all the regular ending, chapter 9. Oh my god, no. This is a March 5th. So wait! I've only... I've gotten 59% of the achievements in this game! Has 59 achievements out of the fucking, and there's 53 more achievements. Is this has to be over soon? End this for me. End me. Velasquez, I don't care about your low-res image of Earth that you stole from some of the game. I don't care. Stop. 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 I'm pretty sure they just took the same face and they just, like, used the mirror thing. Because it looks... No, it's it's different. They drew two separate characters that look almost identical. Oh, great, you're back, Morpheus. Thanks. Thank, thank fucking God Morpheus is back. Don't dot 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 me, bitch. Just, just end it. End me. I'm betting that I didn't learn the the secret backstory of Velasquez in the the fucking uh, badly drawn pair, and then um, a couple of guys that I didn't give a fuck about, and then all the the people from Fantasyland I didn't care about. Um, I learned like. Two or three backstories, but like the cop, I didn't learn his backstory, so I didn't get the achievement for that. So that's that's gotta be some of the 43, right? But there's not 43 characters, so. Th Wait, is this like in heaven? Are you the guardian of heaven? Are you. Is this furry god? Is this fuck furry god? Really? Sympathy for the devil. I mean, honestly, for someone who's just been stabbed in the fucking chest, he's looking pretty normal for him. So it's over. We're done? Another one bites the dust. Yes! I'm looking at the achievements. That's what the sympathy for the devil thing was earlier. Um...
I mean, honestly, for a furry game that there's only one guy with, like, the, the eye scar thing going on, it's pretty good. You know? It's a very... No, I don't... No one will ever care about the save progress of this game. I do not. This... Okay, let me explain something to you about art history. The color blue... That royal blue that you hear about? The reason that it's considered that is because it's really fucking expensive to make blue. Like, really expensive. You have to use... Back in the day, they had to use lapis lazuli, which is a type of mineral, right? And it was the only way you could get blue. And so you'd see these people and they'd make these churches out of entirely just lapis as a way to, like, atone for their sins, you know? It was a, a thing. Um, I forgot what the term is, that you spend money in order to get into heaven. It's a thing that Catholics did for a while. Anyway, um... But kings would have easy access to, like, purple and, and blue and shit like that, right? Um... But just average Joe kind of guys, you would just wear whatever the fuck you could. So in Fantasyland, why the fuck do they have access to purple hair dye? And why are we on the Starship Enterprise? What the fuck is happening? I think I got the bad end, because this guy does not look friendly. But honestly, if everyone in Furryland dies... It's fine. Fine. <sighs> I feel like the game's almost over. I've got to go. Should have left seven minutes ago, but here I am. Being the world's best boyfriend and playing this shit. Rather than picking up my girlfriend. From class. End me. You, you didn't erase right there in between, and then right here as well. And then right here, you've got some, like, your line art layer. You should have, you should have turned that off. Um. Carry on my, carry on wayward son is the name of the achievement. I don't. I don't care what's going on with Nagy. I really fucking don't. Oh, it's the boss fight. B final boss fight. What fucking genre is this game? Aside from visual novel. Like, you have visual novels that are like, you know, Walking Dead is a, a zombie visual novel, right? Uh, based on a comic book. So it's, it's got like, you know, two sub types. Uh, this one's like, Furry, but it's got like eight other subgenre things going on, you know? Congratulations, first name, last name. Yes, I did it. End me. End me. End me. Kill me. Make the game end. Morpheus just fucking in this. Momentary screams of anguish do help me get through this game. I, I'm sorry if they're really annoying. I might. There was only one option there. Why did it give me an option if there weren't options? I would imagine that I had other options if I didn't fuck up whatever was going on in the plot, but I mean, epilogue. Ask me if I give a fuck, man. 
Ask me if I give a fucking shit what happened here. I was gonna look up what the fucking plot of this game is, but you know what? I don't fucking care. It's got a bar of bear and it and fucking boxy's persona. I don't fucking care anymore. I never really did. I just wanted to see if my guess was right, but now, now you're just you're drawing this out, right? This is fucking, it's fucking like that movie Hostile, right? Or Hostile, where the guy like cuts the hamstrings of the people and they don't fucking notice somehow, and then he's like, "You're free to go," and they're like, "Thanks, man," and then they try and run out the door and they fall over because the hamstring's been cut. And they're like, "Ah!" It was like, "You stupid bitch! Could you not feel? Can you not feel pain? This is like that, except for I can feel every fucking second of it." Never again. Oh my god, I fucking love the Sakura games now because they're so fucking short. And if they make me suffer and make me depressed with the content, at least it's for like five fucking minutes. It's not for two hours or however fucking long this was. Fuck! I want to thank everyone who's put up with me through all of this. And they just made a Ramones reference with that achievement. Blitzkrieg pop. Fuck you. I'm not a huge Ramones fan. Really not into them at all. But, you know, they, they didn't. They don't deserve this, man. So I want to I wanna thank everyone who, who stuck with me through this. Um, we've all suffered here. Um, I was going to say but and then go on like why everything was okay. But that that's just pretty much the end of the sentence, isn't it? We've all suffered here today. Thank you for joining me on this. This, this, this journey. She just kind of fucked off, didn't she? Like, she fucked off like 30 minutes ago, or an hour ago, or something. I have no idea how long I've been playing this. I am in pain. Really never wanted to see his face again. There's something just very upsetting about his face. Every time I look at it, I just feel awful. Just stop. I don't fucking care what happened to Daz. I couldn't fucking tell you anything about Daz. But there's there's calm piano music, so apparently this world I see it calls to me. What the fuck? I hear his voice make my choice yesterday is when Okay. It's over! Okay, that was time right there. Right there! What's your story? Fuck! Oh, fuck! What's your Thank plan? Oh. Where you going to? Shit. Where do you stand? Oh. In this moment, take a oh. chance.
I am sorry, I had to get up there for a second. I didn't even realize this music was going on. So these are just like people, like people's fursonas. I'm sorry, Mac Rook Slander. I don't like your fursona. Special thanks. Do not say me. Okay, so this was kickstarted. Fuck you for thanking me! You supported my dream to continue making games. You know what? I'm fine with that. I'm fine with you being happy, doing what makes you happy in life. But do not dedicate this game to me. I don't need that. Are these copyright? These can't be copyrighted songs. These are this, this this game was actually put together by someone. So he's 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 actually gone through the trouble of hiring the music person that did the thing that the fucking I don't give a shit. Stop! Please stop! Please stop! Please stop! Ma stop making that sound! Stop! just experienced but we're never gonna fucking experience it again if you want to buy this game you can get it on steam it's like 10 bucks see you next time no 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 shit fuck it's not Okay, it's over now. That was the epilogue to the epilogue. You can't do that. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Goodbye. Fuck off. Sorry. Goodbye. Not, not... That was two hours. That was two hours of my life there, man. Fucking shit. If you like this video, I do shit like this sometimes. Usually it doesn't take two fucking hours. I'll see you next time.